uh, way that people play the game. So let's go to the game and take a look at some things. Okay, so the first thing I want to draw your attention to, and it's, again, it's sadly hard to do this. It's just that the, the, the zoom in is just really hard to see. We're going to do a zoom in in a second. Um, but right now, just with 4X MSAA, you can see these lines are actually pretty nice. They're, they're, they look like lines. But up here is a bit of a problem, right? You can see there's lots of jaggies, and there's kind of some chunkiness going on. And as best I can tell, those are actually transparent textures. And the problem with MSAA and a transparent texture is that it's looking primarily at the edge. Remember this, uh, the way MSAA works is it's looking at kind of covered or not covered, and that pretty much happens at edges. In the middle, it's always going to say covered, 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 so you don't really do anything. Um, so if you look in here, you can see it's a little chunky. If you look out here on the edges, it's, it's very smooth. That is 4X MSAA. Now what I'd like to do is pull up a full screen of MFAA. All right, now I'm going to use this green box so you can tell this is the MFAA version. We've got these dots up here to tell you that it's on. Is that actually on or is that off? Are you sure that's on? Okay, I'm going to believe you. Sure, that, okay, that's on. All right, so right here is uh, 2X MSAA. So what that means is we're using two samples, right? Two coverage samples. And we're going to do our fancy moving the filter, you know, the filter and moving the sample points to get us an effective form. Let's go to the game. Okay, so the first thing I want to draw your attention to is these lines. And um, it's probably hard to see now because you don't see the other image, but those lines look identical. They are effectively 4X MSAA. Now up here is what some surprise benefit is, is actually in the transparent textures, you get a much better result. Because actually our uh, MSA, I'm sorry, MFAA technology is applied everywhere. Right, so we're changing the sample locations, we're, you know, we're combining across time, and we're actually generating better looking transparent textures. Okay, it's a very cool idea. So why don't we go ahead and, and make it super easy for people to see. Let's do a side by side. So I'd like to see on the left half is now uh, BF4 before with 4X MSAA, and on the right side is MFAA. And if you could do me a swipe back and forth kind of slowly. Okay, so let's focus in on the lines here. And now we're looking at 4X MSA and then swipe across slowly. 4X, swipe it across slowly. We're going to swipe any time now. Oh, I was hoping to go from the other side. All right. But let's look, can you back up a little bit and kind of come right here and then come the other way. All right, go slow the other way. Okay, look at the lines. They are the same. I'll, I'll bet a dollar. They, they look the same. Now let's come to the middle, okay, and then do the same thing. So right now we're looking at MFAA and swipe left. Chunky. Okay, swipe right. Less chunky. Okay, so that's the way this technology works in Battlefield 4. But the most important thing to realize is that even though MFAA looks like 4X MSAA or better, it has the performance of 2X MSAA, right? So it's giving you that bump up in frame rate. Now what I'd like to do, this is the bonus time, and I'm going to ask for your, before I even show it, I want to tell you what we're going to do. We're going to use the built-in scaler in this uh, mixer they're using for the AV, and we're going to zoom in. Now, when we zoom in, it's going to get sadly Gaussian blurred caused by the scaler, right? So it, it's not showing you the pixels the way I want to show you the pixels, because the pixels are dots, right? There's no blur. But when we zoom in, you're going to see a blur, and that blur is caused by the scaler. Okay. So what I want to do first is let's go back to the MSAA side, full screen MSAA, and then zoom into the center. So I want to start with MSAA first, yep, and then zoom into the center, right there. Here we go, this is advanced, excellent. Okay, MSAA now, uh, Matt, could you put the wires we care about there? Awesome. All right, so what you're looking at, these are now actual geometries. Okay, so that's a little wire there, and this is a little flag over there. And this is, remember the, the blurring is coming from the mixer, there's not really blurring. But you can see 4X is doing a pretty nice job of blending around that uh, diagonal geometry, right? And it's doing a pretty good job on this, uh, this edge. That's 4X MSAA. For extra credit, let's try to put MFAA up, full screen. Okay, MFAA zoomed in, full screen. Praise the Lord. All right, Matt, you rock. 
pretty close. All right, so what you're looking at here is now 4X MFAA, the same spot. You can see the edges are looking incredibly similar, and it's because they are mathematically. They are almost identical. And this works in motion. If you, if you can maybe hang back, can you just move a tiny little bit left and right? Let's try that. There you go. So you can see that that, that effect is working even in motion. And you'll get to play with it. You get to look at the demos. It's actually super compelling. Now, can we do a mid-line uh, a 50-50? Awesome. And oh my god. Oh my god, perfect. OK, give me a right. Kind of swipe right. Let's look at MF. This is MSAA you're looking at. OK, all this is MSAA. OK, now swipe left. Go slow. Enjoy it. Oh, oh yeah. OK, that's perfect. You guys, extra candy. Hey, you guys. Todd, great job. Matt, good job. So uh, that's pretty much the demo, right? MF MFAA. Thank you.